Hello, my name is April Claxton, and I am a light worker. I am a psychic medium. I have been working in this field since 2009 with clients locally, uh, nationally, and internationally. Um, and I believe completely in meditation. Uh, meditation and breathing is a way that we can center ourselves. And this meditation today is highly important, not only for me and my own personal experiences with my own mom, but it's really important because this meditation today is going to at least give you a little bit of an insight, a little bit of spiritual healing and awareness into an area of your body, your spirituality, and your relationship with your mom, whether mom is here earthbound or on the other side, uh, that you may not have had before. It's going to bring a little sunshine into possibly a very dark area. So what I ask is that you are in an area, whether it be a bedroom, a living room, uh, and you are uninterrupted. This means putting your cell phone on uh, probably mute. Um, if you are using your cell phone for this meditation, then please at least turn it down um, or do it at a time when you know you won't be bothered. Make sure children are not in the room. Um, maybe give them to a babysitter, your spouse, whatever it may be. Make sure you are alone and you are in a quiet, safe, comfortable place. I ask that you either lay down or you sit down. Make sure if you are laying down that your legs are straight, your feet are facing out. You can cover yourself with a cover if you are cold. Um, I also ask that if you're sitting, make sure that you're just relaxed. Make sure your feet are on the ground. Um, and more than anything, this is your time. We're going to start the music in a few seconds. What I want you to do is I want you to focus on your root chakra. A chakra is a non-physical energy center in your body. We have seven main ones. There are many others. But for the sake of this meditation, we're focusing on one, your root chakra. It is the color of bright, beautiful ruby red when it is balanced. When it is blocked, it is a dark, dark, dark red. Okay, there is not much energy going on there. A chakra is responsible for several different things. Your root chakra is predominantly responsible for you feeling grounded in yourself and in your life. Okay, where you are the center of the cyclone, rather, rather caught up in everything going on around you. So, um, during this meditation, I want you to imagine when the music starts, and I will be talking and guiding you through this, I want you to imagine you feeling at ease. I want you to imagine the beautiful swirling colors of ruby red. You can put sparkles in there. You can. I want you to imagine it circling, and I want you to imagine it. your root chakra is the base of your spine. So yes, this is going to be around your genital area, your rear, okay? This is not a meditation for sexuality. This is not, this is meant for you to uh, focus on that area, okay? Again, the base of your spine. Many of you may feel twinges or um, maybe some kind of energy circling down there. That's normal, okay? This is bringing an awareness and energy to a part of your body where you may not have had any type of healthy energy in a long time in that root chakra. Many of you are listening to this meditation because that area has been blocked. It's the only reason that your guides have somehow um, pulled you here and that's why you've pressed play. So understand that our guides are constantly working with us. Um, and at the end of this meditation, you can find out uh, ways to get in touch with me if you would like your own personal um, intuitive session, private session with me. Moving forward, um, this meditation is going to be different for everybody. Again, whether this meditation is going to heal you in ways where you find that you are grounded in your own life again or in your own self, um, or in ways where you feel grounded with your mom. Okay, many of us, our mom brought us into this world, and many of us have strange or unhealthy relationships with our mom. Again, whether she is earthbound or on the other side, it does not matter. Mom is love and mom is energy. 
okay? Just like we are love and we are energy. So uh, whatever your relationship with your mom is, this meditation is meant to heal and to bring powerful, positive healing light into that chakra area, okay? I do not promise that your mom and you are going to be BFFs forever moving past this. I only promise that this meditation is going to bring light into an area that hasn't had light for a very long time. Many of you may find, as I did through this meditation, that you have an overwhelming surge of energy that may come out as crying. That is called moving energy and that is okay. You may feel an overwhelming feeling of tears. Let it out. Okay, Archangel Michael will be working with us through this meditation. Michael is the blue angel. He is the man of men, angel of angels when it comes to courage and healing. His color is blue, which also goes to the throat chakra, but that's a whole other meditation. Um, but through this meditation, Michael is going to be taking his sword and he's going to be cutting any unhealthy cords that may be associated and connect, connected to your root chakra. So visualize Michael. I will be doing the guided meditation where I will create that visualization for you. If you can't see anything through this meditation, that's fine. Allow in whatever you feel, whatever you see. Guides and angels work with us consistently on levels that you can receive and you can feel. So at this time, I ask that you close your eyes and I ask that you relax. I ask that you slowly take a deep breath in through your nose, breathing in through your throat, your chest, your stomach, all the way down to your root chakra. Hold it. And exhale through your mouth, emptying out your tank. Push it out. Breathe in again through your nose. Two, three, four. Hold it two, three, four, and exhale through your mouth, two, three, four, five. When we breathe in again, I want you to notice any areas within your body that are tense. This is the time to unwind, melt into the bed or the couch or the floor or the chair that you are in. Relax any and all of your joints, bones, and muscles. Your jaw, relax your eyes, your back, your legs. Breathe in, three, four, hold it, two, three, four, and exhale out, two, three, four, and Take a slow, deep breath in through your nose and hold it. And exhale through your mouth. Focus on your spine, your lower spine the base of your spine. Visualize bright red ruby light circling and spinning a sphere a beautiful healing sphere of ruby red light at the base of your spine. This light begins to expand 
and it moves down your legs through your feet creating roots that continue on into the earth I want you to say, I am grounded within the earth. I am grounded in myself. I am grounded in my thoughts and in my feelings. I am grounded in my life. I am grounded in my family. I am grounded in my relationship with my mom. At this point, I want you to visualize your mom, whether she is earthbound or she is on the other side, it matters not. I want you to feel any feelings or emotions that arise. And I want you simply to look at your mom and say, I love you. Send her nothing but healing love. At this point in time, I want you to visualize next to you is the strong, beautiful, encouraging, healing, and loving Archangel Michael. Michael is here to heal and cleanse this relationship and this connection to mom. He pulls out his sword. His sword is large and it is surrounded by white divine light. And it has healing blue flames that run along the blade. At this time, Michael picks up his sword and slowly cuts through any unhealthy cords that are burrowed into your root chakra attached to mom. As he slowly slices through, white divine healing light removes the cord and it disintegrates into universal energy. The hole that is left is immediately healed and soothed with the red ruby light from your root chakra. He also does the same to your mom, cutting the cord with the healing blue white universal divine light her portion of the cord is absorbed and turned into universal energy. And the area left is also healed by her own ruby red light from her root chakra. You both are now surrounded by the divine light of God sources love and protection filled with healing energy.
feel whatever feelings and emotions come up at this point. And I want you to say the words, Mom, Mama, Mommy, Mom, I forgive you. Take a deep breath in and exhale. Take another deep breath in and exhale. Wiggle your toes, your fingers, and slowly come back to my voice. When this meditation is over and you turn off the recording, I want you to have a glass of water. I also want you to get out your journal or a sticky notepad, I don't care what you write on, and I want you to write your thoughts or your feelings that happened during this meditation. Not what you thought of the meditation, but what thoughts or feelings um, arose or transpired through the meditation. What happened when you saw your mom? What happened when the cord was cut? All of these feelings or thoughts are very important. I also want you to realize mom is human. Mom was human if she's on the other side. And being human means we're not perfect. We're perfectly imperfect. Each of us have our own moms. And our own moms have their own moms. And they are only given, they can only give you what they have, what they know. And most of us have expectations of the mom we want rather than the mom we have. So I want you to really realize that mom is on her own path, whether that is a healthy path or an unhealthy path. Mom is able to choose or was able to choose her actions, her thoughts, and her own feelings based on where she is with herself. We cannot change that. All we can do is accept it, work on accepting it. Hopefully this meditation helps you do that. We always want to look at mom and surround her with the white light of God's love and protection and just send loving thoughts and feelings to her because we can't change her. And we have to deal with our own feelings on that. Why would we want to change her? What do we feel when we think of mom? Are we angry? Are we frustrated? Do we want her to choose healthier choices in life? Or did we? Did mom do something that would scar or hurt us forever? Did mom take herself from our life? Whether it be physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, we have to come to terms with what we feel when we think of mom. Are we aching for mom? Are we aching for a mom that our mom just isn't? Did mom change over the years? Is she someone completely different than who she used to be? So we need to come to terms with where we really are with mom. And we need to realize that mom is simply mom as she is. She gave birth to us and that alone is the greatest gift of all. So. Hopefully this meditation will bring a little bit of ease and insight into your relationship with your mother. More than anything, continue to focus on your healthy, spinning, healing root chakra. It is the base of all chakras. It is what grounds us. It is what allows us to feel complete in ourselves and in our lives. And I hope that time only continues to bring love and healing light to you. Be easy with yourself. You aren't perfect either. You are per imperfectly, beautifully uh, perfect. So if you want to uh, reach out to me or contact me or schedule your own personalized session, private session with me, you can reach me at april at the movement within dot com or 843-333-1835. And visit me at www.themovementwithin.com with much gratitude for this space and time as always. We are complete.